Mondale Show on the Edge. Todd has been exploring different websites. We took a little bit of a break. He did the Cougar Life. He did the uh, the Swapper Net one. He did uh, Ashley Madison. Uh, and, and this week, uh, you got a chance to go out with a girl from the com. That's right, Dean. This is a crazy website. Who would have ever thought in your lifetime or ours or mine or Derek's that people want to go out on dates with bigger women? I know. I know. But they do. And uh, they really do. Yeah, well, you, th- it's a huge market. Yeah. There's some guys, you know what they call those guys? You know what they call the guys? I, the, the, the chubby chasers. Exact Mondo. They call them chubby chasers, and you caught up, you chased one all the way to the Mandarin, Todd. Yeah, that's right, and this is just me going to the <laughs> restaurant to meet her. <laughs> all right, I'm uh, heading to the Mandarin. Man, it's neat going on a date with a fat chick, because... <laughs> You're not as nervous. You don't care. Thank you. I'm down this way. Work on the Mandarin. Welcome to the Mandarin. Thanks for having okay. me. Okay, there I am in the back there. Okay. Work on the Mandarin. Welcome to the Mandarin. Hi, how are you? Good. Oh, I kiss all my dudes. Oh, I'll get a kiss. Oh, wow. Okay. Yeah. Your name is again? Jane. I would have never guessed you remember the big and, and the beautiful. I am big and beautiful. I know you are. You're pretty big, aren't you? <laughs> Are you hot in here? Is the air conditioning? Are you sweating a bit? It's really hot in here. How much do you weigh anyway? I'm not telling you. No. I don't tell anybody. Can I guess? Can I take a guess? You go ahead and guess. She's standing up for me right now. I'm going to turn around. You are. Wow, she's bending over and there's children here. Uh, I'm going to guess if you don't mind. Which is 280? Uh, that's pretty good. Yeah? That's pretty good. 280? That's each breast. Are you, are you ready to get right into it? Eat. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Before, oh, I guess we don't need order. We just go up to the buffet, right? Are you excited? I, I'll have something to eat, sure. So I'm going to try and out eat you. Um, You're going to go to town a little bit on the buffet, though, aren't you? I already did at lunch. <laughs> yeah, man. That's just a sample of what's to come. So really now, this is just us going. This is our first round at the buffet. It goes like this. First yeah. Round. Round one. Going up for a first round, first course. <laughs> How are the plates? Are they clean? I always worry about the plates being clean. Huh? Yeah, I, I just sort of. You sure? Okay. Yeah, are you going right to the fried stuff? I eat all the wrong things at all the wrong times. You're not going to the salad section, are you? Uh, Where are you going? Pizza first? <laughs> it's so fun in here, isn't it? What are you having? Uh, I'm gonna do salads first. <laughs> Oh, you're going to go for the shrimp. What an oxymoron. <laughs> you're going for the shrimp first. <laughs> Save some for the rest of everyone, all right? Uh-huh. Uh, it's weird following a, a, following a, a bigger girl getting food. Oh, yeah. oysters. Oh, yeah. Oysters. Just got right into it. This looks really familiar from something I did about three weeks ago. Oh, <laughs> let me guess. You ate oysters. No, it actually looks like something I licked about three le- weeks ago that I never licked before. Oh, my goodness. I can't wait to awesome. learn about that over a salad. That was awesome. Oh, a pickle. Hey, you like the pickles, do you? I prefer the cucumber. Are they touching these spoons because everyone else has touched them? If you want some Caesar salad, you can ask for the, um, for the light dressing. The whole bowl? Sorry? The whole bowl. I think what we should do is have a chicken ball eating contest. Too many chicken balls we shove in our mouths. I don't, I'll I beat like, you. I've probably had more balls in my mouth than you have. Okay, oh, hey, wow. Oh, hi, guys. Welcome to the Mandarin. Okay, we've been here for a while, but thank you. Okay. <laughs> Yeah. They always do that. They always well, you can go to the bathroom and they'll welcome you to the mandarin. <laughs> well, it oh. continues now. We start to eat. Oh. To the mandarin. Oh, get in the. What is that? There, you got. Uh... Reminds me of a girl I once knew. No. Sorry. You have to swallow it whole. Oh. <laughs> oh my god! I'm just gonna look down though, so I don't get grossed out. Is that okay on my meal? <laughs> I'm not going to look at you anymore. Okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> You're drooling. <laughs> You're drooling. Wine. I've had so much wine. Oh, oh my yeah. God. Okay, I'd like a beer. What do, you, what, what do you have again? A Chinese beer. Okay. A Chinese, Chinese latte beer. Do you lose a noodle down your shirt? I save it down here for later. Well, she lost a noodle down her cleavage right now. <laughs> Is that plenty? <laughs> do you see her lose a noodle down her cleavage? <laughs> it probably got twisted around my... Whoa. Okay. <laughs> so get a Qingdao Chinese beer. What Chinese beer? Yeah. It's, it's good? Back to eating. Yeah. You enjoying that? <laughs> That's not fair. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you lost a noodle down your cleavage. That was so funny. But it's a nice cleavage. Yeah, it's pretty good. And you got tats on there. You got little tats and a little piercing. That's a big tat. Not, not much little on you. <laughs> Can you a little bit? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm-hmm
Oh, she's choking. The seafood sauce. I swallow everything. I know, I know. Like a vacuum. You gotta chew your food. Don't bite it, just swallow it whole. You know what's amazing? Uh, t- folks, if, in case you're wondering, uh, this is Todd went on a date with a woman who was nearly 300 pounds from the the big and the beautiful dot com, and uh, and that's they're at the Mandarin eating. These are the clips you're hearing. You can check out all the big girls and pick them up. But what amazes me is how how excellent this is because she she's eating so fast she choked on her food. Yes. That's what I just heard. Right? And she lost a noodle down her cleavage. <laughs> she was going to go find it later. And our server was laughing. <laughs> All right, here's more. This uh, yeah, we continue right now. Four kinds of men, like BBWs. Big, there beautiful is women. The man boy who always, always, always just dates BBWs. Likes a big girl. Likes bigger, likes bigger women, yes. And then there is the moped man. What's that? The moped man is a man who wants to have sex with the BBW, but he doesn't want his friends to know. Mm. So it's like a moped, right? When you go away, you want to yeah, always try a moped. That'd be me for sure. That'd be me for sure. But you never want your friends yeah, to know. I wouldn't want it. Like, I'm even embarrassed being out here in public with you. Oh, okay. <laughs> Is the the perfect man? You want to buy my chicken ball? I'm good. I thank you. The perfect man has yeah, had. You're bigger than I thought you'd be. Really? Yeah. yeah. Like you're a big. You're a big lady. I can be. Yeah. yeah you're, you're fat with a ph though. Well. You hate that word. The f letter. The f word. You don't like fat? No. My girlfriend always told me there's two words you don't call a woman. They both start with a c. One of them is the, <laughs> and the other's chunk. Oh, Chunk, I don't mind. You don't mind Chunk? All right, I'm here with Miss Chunk. Chunk. You said there are four type of men. You only told me three. Oh, and then there is the one who really has no idea what he wants, and he'll just f*** anyone. Oh, okay. And that's who you don't oh, mind. You're yeah, bad. yeah. You know what's worse than just being, being? oh, I can't say fat. You know what's worse than being Chunk? Like Chunky? What? Being Chunky with herpes. <gasps> that would be horrible. <laughs> to be Chunky with herpes. God, oh, my God. <laughs> Uh, okay, we got a couple more here. Uh, listen to this exchange. Just listen. <laughs> I have a theory on uh, on uh, the bigger ones. Oh. Their are are uh, tighter because because they're because their big ass thighs keep it together. That could be. I've, I've been I've been single for four years. Oh, were you married? Oh God, yeah. Really? Yes. Wow, he found it, eh? <laughs> so would he roll you around in flour and like look for the wet spot? Is that uh-huh. no? No. Yeah. Yeah. I'm writing a book. Do all the chairs support you? Yeah. You've never broken a chair? Never. What about a stool? Or a bed. You've broken a bed or, or two. Yes, but that was mostly because of, you know. What's your uh, what's your vertical? <laughs> what's your vertical? Well, I I don't jump. I walk. I vacation. Welcome to the Mandarin. Welcome to the Mandarin. Thank you very much for having a good time. I'm on a bike. Mm. Uh, Copenhagen. Really? Yeah, it wasn't, wasn't pretty. <laughs> Come on, it wasn't pretty. Uh, I like you. I went to Copenhagen because there's the number one restaurant in the world. Of course, so you went to eat. Copenhagen. <laughs> That's a bad person's destination, eh? I'm a chef. <laughs> yeah, of course you're a chef. I, look at my... no, I believe you. I'm just wondering, do you ever get to the point where you serve the food to people? Or are you too busy finishing it in the kitchen? <laughs> You're beautiful. I am an unbelievable. You're big and beautiful. Let's go for a second round. I uh, can't wait. <laughs> you want to hear that second round? Yeah. yeah. Okay, here it is. <laughs> beautiful men over here. I quite like about half of them. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I bet you they quite like uh, half of you. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. That's really good. Uh, Backing up for the sushi. <laughs> That's a good morning. She just nailed me in the gut. How's the sushi? Excellent. Yeah? Oh, I love sushi. Okay. <gasps> Spicy crab. Yeah. Teriyaki meatballs, you think those are good? Oh, they look good. Mixing meatballs with sushi. I never know about the plates here. Really? You sure they're... I don't know. Such a pussy. <laughs> 
I dated someone who lived in the trifecta of cheese factories. Oh, if you dated a guy who just could bring home cheese. Oh, yeah. You ever get crust cake? Never. You're pretty regular? I'm very regular. Okay. Curry's delicious. No, I hate curry. I can't believe you're eating. We got wait a second. Hey, don't, don't grab the cheesecake yet, okay? Little baby pizza. That's so we got pizza, sushi, and meatballs. Jane's food, guys. Hi, how are you? Welcome to the mango. Uh, what, what do you have here? What's it called? Pine rib. Sorry? It's pine rib. So is that Asian food? No, it's a western. It's a steak. Oh, okay, okay. Do you like horse? <laughs> no. Because <laughs> you look like one. You wait until I kick. Okay. <laughs> Just a couple more clips from Todd's date with a 300-pounder from the Big and the Beautiful dot com. Her name is Jane. She's actually a lot of fun. A lot of fun. And if yeah. you're into this thing, man, go find her because she'll have a lot of fun with you. And here we'll just pick it up with me asking her a bunch of questions that I'm sure many of us would love to ask a bigger girl. Okay. Can I ask you a question? Love men. You know, like when people drive uh, Corvettes, they all, they all wave at each other. Mm. You know, there's kind of like Larry David's always said, there's a bald connection. No. You got to support the bald team. Mm. Is that the same? Is that the same deal for the? Uh, for the gigantic ones? Absolutely. Yeah. We all sort of nod to each other. I wonder if you could fit in my car. Oh. What do you drive? A little convertible. No, no. No. Do you get gassy? Never. Mm. Oh, it's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that is very cool. I've never had some yeah, ice cream. Yeah. Usually that's on my... You do that? You let guys eat food off you? Of course. You're not fighting them for it, trying to get to it first? <laughs> Do you ever steal stuff in your fat folds? No, that would be unhygienic. You put anything under, that, under a t- or anything? A pencil. You know those wood logs that those lumberjacks roll on in, in, in lumberjack competitions? You could stick one of, the, one of those under your teeth and you'd be fine. So you don't worry about uh, like heart attacks or anything? No. Are you done with that? Sir? Uh, yeah, I'm done. Are you, are you sure? Maybe I should clean your plate. Okay. Okay. <laughs> wow. Did she really clean it? Dude, I'll get honest, after it. Yeah, that was the dessert play too, right? So oh, wow. there was some good stuff. We had chocolate ice cream and grape ice cream and sprinkles on it all. It was really fun. <laughs> the manner is the best. Yeah. So here we go now. This is uh this is me really trying to have some fun with her. You ready? Yes. Your mama's so fat. God told her he had no room in heaven, and the devil said there's no room in hell. <laughs> That's terrible. Your mama's so fat, when she went to the movies, she sat next to everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Your mama's so fat, when a beeper goes off, people thought she was backing up. <laughs> I did that already. That's a, she can. That's a great joke. Uh, Your mama's so fat, her nickname is Lotto. Aww. <laughs> That's Chris Go. Chris Go, okay, okay. I know, those are mean, eh? So collegiate humor. Your mama's so fat, she sells shade in the summer. <laughs> Your mama's so fat, when she get a cut, she bleeds milkshakes. <laughs> Awesome. <laughs> then you lick it up. I would take that. <laughs> that was my favorite. Yo, your mom's so fat when she walked by the TV. I missed three episodes. <laughs> <laughs> your mom was so fat she pays taxes in three different countries. <laughs> I can believe uh, that you're in Europe. <laughs> your mom was so fat she whistles bass. <laughs> Your mama's so fat, she has a homeless family living under her t- <laughs> Your mama's so fat, when she plays hopscotch. You remember, you remember hopscotch? I do remember hopscotch. Yeah, she goes BC, Edmonton, Toronto, <laughs> Montreal. <laughs> yeah. Fat jokes with a fat chick. That's awesome. <laughs> I know. Well, Anybody the- that can get away with it, that's good news. <laughs> Thank God I'm still alive. So here we go. This is us just wrapping up the date. Okay. Your mama's so fat when she lie on the beach. People run around her screaming, going, free Willie! <laughs> Big and beautiful. Great senses of humor. Go find Jane on there. She's an absolutely stunning lady. You remind me of an ex-girlfriend, by the way. Oh, really? Yeah, a little bit. But I saw the fat potential. <laughs> My Hotmail, Jane Smith, 1960. And on The Big and the Beautiful, I'm Jane Smith. These girls do exactly what every girl doesn't because... We love it. Oh, (laughs) not we have to. (laughs) And as we said earlier, they will eat you up. We eat it whole and swallow. They don't binge and purge (laughs) where their teeth aren't rotting. Hey, your mama's so fat. Stop it. She's got to iron her pants on the drive. <laughs> Your mama's so fat. When she wears one of those jackets with an X on the back, 
helicopters try to land on her. <laughs> That's your sugar puff. <laughs> you are what you eat. You know what that makes you? I'm everything. You're the Mandarin. <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, thank you. Thank you very much. Great dinner. Welcome to Mandarin. Okay, we're going. Okay, thank you so much. We had a great time. I'm stuffed. How are you doing? I'm ready for more. <laughs> <laughs> the Dean Bundell Show. On the edge. Welcome to Mandarin.